now focus tell you about how it is day 2 of congress's bharat jodo nyay yatra 2.0 today the yatra is resuming from sekma impal west following with public addresses at kangpoki and in senapati now the night halt will be at kuzuma ground nagaland both rahul gandhi and congress president malikarjun kharge took a dig at prime minister modi for the crisis in manipur in fact, Rahul Gandhi accused the Prime Minister of not considering Manipur a part of the country. The Congress has called it an ideological yatra and not an electoral yatra. But this comes as the nation prepares for its biggest elections in few months from now. All right, these are the latest visuals as far as Bharat Jodo Nyaya Yatra is concerned, what you're seeing on your screens as well. This, is, remember, is a 6,700-kilometer long yatra that is underway. As far as what the Congress um, does state, uh, going on to mention that it is an ideological yatra, not an electoral yatra. But what does day two have in store? Let's find out from my colleague Niamika. Niamika, good morning. Of course, it's day two. There have been uh, important uh, statements that did come on day one. But just to give our viewers a quick sense of what one can expect from day two of the yatra. Well, actually, this is uh, the second day of the Bharat Horan Yatra, which is uh, being resumed from uh, the Sikma area or from Manipur as uh, uh, Rahul Gandhi is currently interacting with the, the common man of this, uh, uh, the state of Manipur as uh, this yatra is uh, being resumed from the Sikmai area of Impal Death. And after that, he is also going to address uh, a, a, a public meeting uh, from the bus only for in uh, the area of Kansas City. And after that, uh, there will be a uh, press conference as well on the part of the Congress leader, Samaya Kumar, at Karan uh, Brown, uh, in which uh, he is going to address uh, uh, the media regarding the yatra. Only as to the Congress party has been continuously saying that this is an ideological yatra. Rahul Gandhi has come to listen to the voices of the uh, people of Manipur because they have faced a lot of issues, they have faced a lot of problems, and that is the reason why Congress is there to listen to their problems and demand for the justice of all these people uh, who have uh, who have faced the violence in the past eight months. As uh, the Congress party has also attacked the government of India and Prime Minister Narendra Modi by saying that he kept. Right, Niamika, I'd have to interject you there because I'm afraid we're running short of time. But thank you very much for getting us those inputs. Uh, for the moment, we leave it to that. But also